that. Then again, it's a really long cost afterwards, but still. Um, am I stunned again? May have been. bit low here. Alright. Out of combat at least. Or it should be. Hardest part. Picking up the goddamn latch. Here we go. Expecting a bigger fight now. <laughs> or that thing. Easy. I'm just trying to find out what happened. Is that Sarah Hawk? You have enemies. I'm glad it's you, really. <sighs> These poor people. You are a much better target. So, care to explain your particular brand of crazy? Kanari take my people. My siblings forget their culture, then go to the Kuhn for purpose. We're losing them twice. So I get some help from your people. We'll take the Kanari Thunder, make some accidents, and make them hate it. But this... This is all wrong. You were going to kill people anyway. That's... not funny at all, really. It can still work. They're hidden in your city. They'll enrage the faithful and make sure the Kunari are blamed. Me, I'm finished. I just need a few more bodies. A few more. Well, not gonna be us. That's for damn sure. Elven fanatic, yeah, you can say that. You can say that. Why is everybody so goddamn spread out? Really doesn't help me. Hmm. Did he freeze like that? Nice. <laughs> That's the <to> suck. <laughs> All right, fanatic. Bye bye, fanatic. Mm, can I get a third? Somehow. This uh, wasn't actually a hard fight. Yeah, looking at our health. There's no real damage done there. Time to tell the Ari Shark how he was right and wrong. Um there we go. The brothers is in. I hmm, think uh, you definitely have your, uh... Again, fire damage. Stop it with all the fire damage stuff. <laughs> I guess uh, they're really just expecting you to go for all the fireball spells and stuff. So much fire damage. <laughs> yeah, Fenris, that's uh, probably your next sword. Or, I guess, your current sword. Mm, yes. Yes, indeed. Ooh, nice and nasty looking. <laughs> that would really hurt. That's for damn sure. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not sure on the belts. 100% physical. That's right, actually. What am I wearing? That's okay. Survivors are finally creeping out. Thank you, Lucille. All right. Um, yep, docks. I make a quick left turn. Oh, I wonder if Isabella is just gonna. Hey, I think I knew that man back in Antiva. Bye. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> was wrong about our thief. It appears so. They say we were careless with our trap, that this is our fault. But even without the Sarkamek, there would have been death. This elf was determined to lay blame at our feet. Selfishness, want, denial. How do you allow this to continue? Hmm... If you won't talk straight, then we won't talk. Hold. Oh. Since we arrived, I have seen nothing but greed and weakness. Dwarves, humans, elves, just festering. No order, no goal. You are one of the few I have met with any ability. And yet this too was random, a result of selfishness. I cannot fathom how a mire like this can be justified. You turned from me. Do you turn as easily from all this chaos? Hmm. Yeah, it's life. Glorious and wild. Why would anyone want to change it? You like it? <laughs> it's a city of people living their lives, for good or ill. Karisten are soldiers. The Kuhn made it so. They can never vary from that assigned path, never be other than they are meant to be. But they are free to choose within that role, to accept and succeed, or deny and die. Glory is clear and defined. You allow chaos for good or ill, but one is clearly superior. Can you see how that certainty would benefit this whole city? Um... Yeah, is that a threat? Sorry, I find myself distracted by deny and die. And yet you accept the random violence that plagues this nation. Happens everywhere. I wonder if the weaker of your citizens would be so close to certainty. Your kind may force our role to change, if the Kuhn demands. Why aren't you more concerned about her supporters? Our enemies strike from shadow because they cannot stand before us. This is not a revelation. And it doesn't matter. I am not here to fight. I am here to satisfy a demand you cannot understand. It's been a long time. It will take as long as needed. No ship is coming. There is no rescue from duty to the Kuhn. I am stuck here. You could have built a ship by now, you know. It is not about a ship. Filth stole from us. Not now, not the Sarkamek. Years ago. A simple act of greed has bound me. We are all denied Parvalin until I alone recover what was lost under my command. That is why this elf and her shadows are unimportant. That is why I do not simply walk from this pustule of a city. Fixing your mess is not the demand of the Kune, and you should all be grateful! Fuck off. I don't give a shit about you. Just walk, be gone, do do whatever you damn well please. Thank you, human. 
for your service. Leave. I really... He's ill at ease. The Viscount should know. Yeah, he is gonna just get up and, you know, murder the entire city. He is gonna do that. And boy, will I look forward to mashing his face in, because I don't like the guy. Don't like the guy at all. Alright, let's um, make a stop at our home before we uh, go to the Viscount. Uh, letters. Where were you letters? <laughs> self spot, nice. I'm I'm not even sure if self spot is a thing in English, but um, yeah, I'm okay on that stuff. Just being able to writing desk. Hawk, I found a lead on our cargo theft. I have urgent need of your expertise. You mean High Town Market? Okay. Uh, Messer Hawk, I wanted to thank you for helping my brother. I worry about what the Templars will do to Karen, but it's what he wants. He's grateful that you defended him before Sir Colin. I've noticed your considerable talents and have an oppor opportunity that may be of interest to you. Meet me in Hightown at midnight. Discretion is key. A friend. Hmm, not sure on that. <laughs> Enchantment Adventures? Okay. Yeah, you know, for those who want to read, go right ahead. <laughs> I haven't actually thoroughly examined this place, ah, have I? this statue. Wait, where did I get this statue? Don't tell me. <laughs> or no, don't ask me, even. Fenris said Daenerys left this at the mansion. I came in and watered your plants. Your friend, Meryl. Well, that was nice of her. Indeed. Seems like uh, something uh, Meryl would do. Complete people's laws of Kirkwall. A friendly reminder from Aveline. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Very nice. Alright, so I think we're uh, done here. Oh, that dog. Well, maybe two marks add character to the piece. <laughs> nice. Nice little touches there. All right, let's go with that. Yeah, I like that group. All right, Viscount Keep. This ought to be interesting. And then here, looking well. also yes, with the coin sound. Nice, quiet anxiety. Gone. <laughs> Along with a whole street. The Canari were blameless. Right. A mad elf pushed by zealots, likely hidden in the very groups I have to appease. The Maker has a grand sense of humor. And the Arishok. I suspected he had no plans to leave. I didn't know it was just as annoying for him. Hmm. He's a hair from the edge. You need to keep everyone calm. Too late, I fear. It's a shame. He was making overtures of cordialness. Your influence, no doubt. What happened? A Konari delegate and entourage paid me a visit. It was civil, tentative, hopeful. They left my chambers with precision, but were not reported by the outer guard. They are missing almost literally from my doorstep. 
What do you imagine will be the Arishok's reaction? Do the Kunari generally keep you updated? Kunari do not disappear. They know we watch, and they are not shy about their movement. Speak to Seneschal Brown. He has details that show how damning this is. I don't know who would benefit from fighting the Kunari, but it will cost all of us. Well, that would indeed be horrible. You have information about the missing Kunari? I am to help you, yes. Viscount Dumas would appreciate discretion in this matter. I would prefer that you were not involved at all. But that is neither here nor there. I'm sure you have suspicions about what happened. My concerns are well founded. This could not have escaped the notice of the city guard. Unless they were involved. Not coincidentally, a number of recent recruits have failed to report. You should start with one of them. Although where you find a swordsman so eager to sell his honor and duty, I'm sure I don't know. The hanged man. Hanged man. Even I know that. <laughs> right. Then you know what to look for. I can't imagine this has occurred without notice. There is always a weak link. Please keep this quiet. The Viscount is under enough scrutiny as it is. Indeed. Well, this is going to be, uh, you know, the thing that st starts the war. <laughs> Something like that. Um, guess we got to be at night. Yeah. I mean, who goes to the hanged man during the day, right? So this seems to be a side quest. Well, you're throwing coins around like there's no tomorrow. That's right, woman. Tonight I'm paid and blessed, and all I had to do was turn my head. Ooh. Interesting. To all my friends. Hey, step back. I know important people. We're going to show this city what to do with heathen oxmen. Hmm. Someone has deep pockets. I want an introduction. Somebody always wants something. But I don't have to take that anymore. Three horn heads are just a start. You want some of this? Take it from me and my new friends. You're on your own, pal. That's loyalty for you. Come on. Really? Really? You guys want to fight it out. Okay. It's clear that you have no clue who you're dealing with. Good. Now, just tell me who and where. Templar. It was a Templar. I didn't get the name. We met near the Chantry. He, he said taking these Kunari was serving the Maker. I swear, he even had the seal of the Grand Cleric. True is true. There's probably not many to have that, is it? You have got to be kidding me. A Templar? Her grace would never be involved in something like this. Hmm. Well, see there's another quest, so might as well pop in here. Ah, talking to Varric. Hawk, I've got some news. You might not want to be near anything breakable when I tell you, though. Um... Varric, whatever you have to tell me, it'll be fine. I know, I know. 
Clive had an ear out for Bartran. After the deep roads, he ran to Ravane, probably because he knew I couldn't track him. But I hear he might be back in Kirkwall. He called in loans from a few of his contacts in Hightown. Um, you should probably forget about him. Just let it be. You don't want to have to kill him, do you? How are you holding up, Beric? <laughs> Me? My no-account backstabbing brother is practically in arm's reach. I couldn't be better. Okay, well, let's do it. We need some answers from your brother. I agree. Bianca's been missing him something awful. Let's stop by his new house. Welcome him back to the neighborhood and all that. Alright, well... Let's head out. And... I have no clue what quest I now want to do. Um... I think it was offered and lost. I think it was that. And considering the location, that seems to be correct. The man was a drunk. Surely you don't think Grand Cleric Elthina is funding zealots? One way to find out. It's a careful chat about missing Kunari. Keep an open mind, Hawk. Elthina isn't behind this. The Grand Cleric, please. Tell her... Tell her... It concerns the Canari. Sarah Hawk. Sister Patrice. Mother Patrice. Time has changed us both. Grand Cleric Elfina cannot grant an audience to just anyone. What do you want? Hmm. Funny how you and issues with the Kunari seem to go together. And you always assume their side. No, I don't. I was naive when last we met. I did not want you dead, but I felt a death was necessary. That may be too fine a point for you to understand. But you must admit, you came out the better for it. A Templar may have misjudged an order and abused the Grand Cleric's authority. I assure you, the Templars would never embarrass the Chantry, at risk of the Knight Commander's wrath. Men were hired for the righteous task of kidnapping a Canari delegate. A pause that says you knew, but does her grace? The Grand Cleric trusts her stewards to enact the wishes of the Maker. I doubt she would approve, and she will hear of it. Stubborn. All right, Sarah Hawk. If you won't abandon this, let me offer you something. Let me offer you the something. The Templar you seek is a radical who has grown unreliable. Confronting him may do us all a favor. A.K.A. you. And he is what to you? He is my former bodyguard, Sir Von L. Assume what you wish, but I offer him to you as... Reconciliation. No, won't Meet do. Meet me at this location. I invite you, Sarah Hawk. Come see the unrest these Kunari have inspired. I invite you, Sarah Hawk, to walk into a trap. Exactly. It's her game, for the moment. Ah, uh, I just. Uh, I want to I kill you her. Talk about vulgar things quite a bit. Do you want me to stop? Do I make you uncomfortable? It was just an observation, really. It's a bad habit I picked up spending years with foul-mouthed pirates. Pirates only care about a small number of very specific things. The sea, strong drink, and booty. Both kinds. <laughs> I like the uh, both kinds bit. That's, that's rather clever. Clever, yet so predictable, really. <laughs> but I never would have thought of that. So, looking for a room full of armed zealots. Patrice is here somewhere. Whoops. Cut off the dialogue by saving. 
Ah, oh, here they are. Like any beast, remove the fangs and it is lost. They are weak before the faithful of the Maker. The only certainty in their precious cune is death before the righteous. Sevonel! Take a knee, faithful. The Chantry blesses us. You claim a blessing when you have used the authority of the Grand Cleric so openly? You have brought wrath down upon you. You remember Sarah Hawk? The Kunari have friends, Templar. How will you answer their allegations? You want to fight? Face someone whose weapons are not bound. I could have I could have killed him by Destroy them. And she just runs like a coward bitch she is. All right. Ooh, there's more. <laughs> All right. That was a complete miss. You need to drink. I need spells that are not on cooldown. Come on, something get off cooldown. Like that. Dude, they really have it in for you. Does he have some aerial taunt or something? Because, what the fuck? How does he get all the, uh, the attention? I really don't know. Okay, you know what? There's actually a whole lot of them. Holy shit. Yeah, I need to use more potions. I thought this was gonna be okay, but... They just keep on coming. They really just keep on coming. Yeah. Okay, um... Well... I'll just load the last save from here. Interesting. Did not expect this to be a difficult fight. It's like, okay, I'll just kill the entire group, kill him, okay, done. No, there's multiple ways of these giant groups. That that bit I don't like. Um, well, I guess everyone just go, you know, attack him. Well, I summon Buster Witch. And AoE. I think we just kind of need to stick together, and I think we'll be okay. Alright, you drink up. I just uh, shocked a whole lot of them, so they'll uh, be attacking me. Indeed they are. Oh wow. I was gonna say, is that potion gonna do anything today or I wonder if these just keep coming regardless. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Um I 